Moving on out to Silsby. I'm sure that field was pretty muddy for the game against the Nederland Bulldogs. Let's check it out. Tigers excited to be back at home for the first time this season as well. First play, though, the field conditions plague them. You're going to see a fumble. The ball's on the ground. Eventually gets picked up by Chris Martin, who tries to bounce it outside, wow. but ends up slipping and falling. Tigers forced to punt. Hey, youth football night in Silsby. Got to start him young, Jay. Defense would respond with the Bulldogs threatening senior Blason Fernandez fires to the end zone, but look at Darshawn Turk with the pick. Oh, nice stuff right Defense. there. After another Silsby punt, Needleman would finally get on the board thanks to sophomore Cade Scott, who takes it up the middle and says, see ya. That's a nice touchdown for the Bulldogs. Needleman rolling. Kids on the Bulldog side getting pumped up as we go to the final scoreboard here. Needleman wins a shootout in the mud. Wow. 35 One to 28. So the Bulldogs are now 3-0 on Ooh. the young season as well. Silsby might be the best 0-3 team in the state of Texas. I'm just really? going to go ahead and say it. I'm, I'm not going to go against Silsby plays that. PNG. Yeah. Then goes schedule. up and plays Newton and then loses tonight to Needleland. Yeah. And they and still you, have a remaining tough schedule. So. You know, and a shout-out to Needleland, too, because they've had a pretty rough schedule, too, right. and they've been able to win those close games. So shout-out to them. There you go. So I Needleland's mean, ready to go. United hung with them for a half. They had tight game out here, 19-18 win over yes. West Orange in the first game of the year. And then, of course, tonight pulling it out in tiger country all right we had another thing going on here it's not just the game on the field every 